showing a clean sound with the SP, the new compressor from Exotic. But uh, I discovered that it also sounds good with distortion, and that's something I never in a million years would have thought I would try using a compressor with my distortion sound, because there's inherently so much compression in distortion that, that you'd never use a pedal with it, or would you? But um, anyway, I, I discovered it by accident. I just left it on for a couple of solos at a live gig, and I went, wow, man, that, that sound made it sound even better, and it started to get a little more pick attack. I mean, I wouldn't use it on for all my distortion, but it, it does do a thing. So... <laughs> fat mid mid sound to it and you hear the pick attack <laughs> Another thing that, that all you guys already know about is the EP Booster, but it sure uh, is another pedal that I keep coming back to as, as just a booster. Like, for instance, the sound I have up now. <laughs> real true sound. I actually have my EP set so it doesn't darken the sound. It's just like a clean boost. But it's a good sound. It's a it's a it's like a thick boost. <laughs> Another thing, uh, a lot of guys use an RC boost for their clean sound. I know I was, um, but again, lately I've been using it uh, as, as a distortion boost too, and it, I, I find that it it almost um, it sort of sharpens the sound, and you lose some of the woofy sound, uh, especially for solos. It's really good. Like this is without it. Subtle. I don't know if it's coming across on the video, but you can really feel the difference when you use it. And I have it set for just uh, uh, a little bit of boost, no distortion really. <laughs> Thank you. 
Anyway, fun stuff.